Yo guys, what's up and welcome back to another video here on Sankan's YouTube channel. And today we've got our first ever midweek game on this channel. We're going to Hillsborough tonight and I tell you what, Hillsborough is a very tough place to go. I think Wednesday sits 7th or 8th in the championships table. They've got some very good players with the likes of Barry Bannon. They've got Stephen Fletcher who could say is past it now. But he's, do, he's been doing, to be fair to the lad, he's been doing very well this season for Sheffield Wednesday. Uh, another annoying thing is that they've obviously got Atty New, who, who is very much a player that you love if he's on your team, but you absolutely hate if he's on if he's against you. And he's a great player for Sheffield Wednesday to bring off the bench late on and snatch a win or snatch a point. Uh, last time I went to Hillsborough, it finished 2-2, and it was a good game. We started off really well. Benica Fobi scoring uh, both goals for the club. Um, but then, sadly, uh, Atty who and Barry Bannon snatched it late on to make it 2-2. So I'm hoping we can get our third win on the bounce for the first time in three and a half years. So this this team could make history today. They could be absolute limbs in the away end. Let's go down to Sheffield. <laughs> Guys, you've just arrived here at Sheffield, aka Hillsborough, and I'll admit I am incredibly cold at the moment. That's why I've got my lovely night jacket on here. Um, I forgot to say in my intro the predictions for the game today. I'm going to go with the 1-1 and I take a 1-1 because, like I did say in the intro, they're a very, very, very good side, Sheffield Wednesday are. And they're going to be tough to beat and to be fair, if we could go three games unbeaten, I would be incredibly happy. So uh, I'll see you when we get to the ground. So guys, we've just seen the team lineups for today. Only one change. Bruno comes in. Quick story, quick story to tell you about Bruno. And this is a commitment story. This is what we like to see from our players, right? At half time of the game against Fulham, he was throwing up. He was uh, he was sick, but he decided he wanted to play on. He could hardly notice he was ill. He was a brilliant player, he normally is, but he's not. He's the one change is that he's not starting today. In comes Stephen Ward, who I haven't actually seen that often, so I'm quite interested to see how he does against Wednesday's quite potent attack. Uh, so let's get into the ground. Before you come to break down the door, fuck 
give me the water, I just couldn't take any more. chance for Stephen Fletcher. The game isn't the most exciting one so far. Annoyingly, I can't see the scoreboard, so I don't know how long we are into the game. Atibo's down at the minute, which isn't too good at all because he's like one of our star men in the squad. It looks, I can't I think, Oh, Mark Duffy's coming on. Now, story about Mark Duffy, he formerly played, well, he's on loan from Sheffield United, and we're against Sheffield Wednesday. So I'd love Duffy to score. It's getting ready on the bench. Atibo's coming off, Duffy's coming off. Go on, Duffy! looking really tired today because they put such a shift in against Fulham on Saturday looking exhausted come on oh, it's three minutes to the break here now at Sheffield Wednesday Hillsborough <laughs> this half's gone so quick but it's not that it's been exciting uh oh uh oh oh no Say, but that's poor defending from Lindsay. You know, he's been looking really solid for the club so far this season, but that's just sorry, that's not good enough. Uh, it was taken very well by Luongo, the former QPR midfielder, but we have to defend better than that. Sheffield Wednesday won Stoke now. Mm. Mm, so it's half time here at Hillsborough and 
it's not going to plan we'll leave it at that you know so far we've been completely brought back down to reality and it's not been a great performance but my prediction 1-1 one, one is still on so you know i guess i'm praying for a 1-1 one, one in the second half because we can improve we saw against Fulham, we're a better side than what we're showing tonight we need to get into the second half and perform come on come on, come on boys You can't lie, the fans today were so great, a great following, great support. Oh, we're the Reds, go and watch it. Oh, we're the Reds, go and watch it. Like, the fans have been brilliant today. They've came in the numbers, they've supported the club. <laughs> nice. Wait for it, wait for it. about it we're playing really well that was the save of the season then by Cameron Dawson someone has to be following that up. Olé, olé. Olé, olé, olé. Olé, olé. let's just sit down and reflect on the game it's been great <laughs> oh we're doing it I don't know what I'm singing, but I love this song. I wish we did it all the time. Look at them up there. Look at the top. So, yeah. I mean, if Wednesday to get a second, they really don't deserve it. I think it generally, neutrally, deserves to be a 1-1 one, one draw today. So, it is what it is, and just have to move on. But there's still 10 minutes. There's still 10 minutes, there's still that 
0.00001% that we can pull this back. Come on. defensive error that cost us the game today but it wasn't just the team players that cost the game today it was the blooming referee I mean there were so many decisions like you saw that penalty that Barry Bannon gave against Joe Allen it was such a clear penalty and that could have easily put us 1-1 and we'd have come away here with a point you can't moan at the fans they were absolutely fantastic today they were singing all the way through and I'm sorry but I'm gonna have to end my match day vlog on a bad note. The Stewarts at Sheffield Wednesday are absolutely appalling, okay? Because all I wanted to do was do an outro, which I'm allowed to do at every other club. You've seen it before on every other vlog, but apparently these Stewarts at Sheffield Wednesday are like, oh, can you hurry up, please? I don't, I don't think you're allowed to do that, please. So we got kicked out for no particular reason. So if you're a vlogger uh, that, you know, has a lot of subscribers, or not, not even a lot of subscribers, Remember not to come to Sheffield Wednesday and do a vlog because the Stuarts are just going to ruin it. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed it today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. That's Sam Cam. Peace out. Thank you. 